am Lacey with the Sweet Nation Podcast, and I'm here in Louisville, Kentucky with John, the general manager of Tempted. He's going to take us on a tour today. Welcome to Club Tempted. Uh, we want to welcome you and remind everybody that entrance to Club Tempted is in the rear of the building. You'll come in on the back deck and be greeted right here by your door check-in. You can either purchase your tickets online in advance or at the door, but if you purchase them at the door, you take a risk because we do sell out. So be sure to watch those events closely. All right, again, welcome. You are now at Club Tempted's bar area. Upon your first visit, we always ask everybody to get here prior to nine o'clock so that we can give them a tour of the facility, show them how everything works, answer any short questions that they may have. We are a BYOB facility, so remember that you can bring your alcohol in, check it in here at the bar, or carry it with you around. It's entirely up to you. Just be responsible and be mindful of cooler clutter. Uh, we have fountain machine, ice machine, everything else over here for you to make your drinks and mix up and do whatever you want. And uh, any questions that you may have at any time, you can ask any of our bartenders or staff and they'll be glad to help you. Okay, John, tell us about the coffee bar and your food setup. Awesome. Well, we have a lot of folks here that enjoy, you know, having a nice cup of coffee. Some people don't drink. So we wanted to make sure that they had an option and a variety to choose from. So Tanya was gracious enough to set us up with a nice coffee bar. And then over here, we have our food area too. On our Friday nights, we have snacky foods. Saturday nights, we have light meals. And then our big events, we cater in or put up some sort of menu for people to choose from. Awesome. That's how that works. All right, welcome to Club Tempted's locker room. All of our lockers are first come, first serve, as you can see. And you can store your gear in here and also use our changing area and vanities to get ready. Awesome. Do you charge for the lockers? Are they included in your membership? They are included in the membership. All that we ask is that you bring a lock from home. And if you don't remember one, don't panic. Just go to the bar, get a name tag or piece of paper and just stick it on there so you remember where your gear is at. Awesome. All right. Welcome to our first floor VIP where all the magic happens. The VIP seats can be bought individually. You can buy as many as you want, up to 50 to rent the whole room out. In here, anything goes. The moment you come in, this is the exception to the whole club. It's kind of like if you could imagine the boom boom room of the old <laughs> days. <laughs> it's, a, it's a lot of fun. You'll have a VIP attendant. You'll have drinks and everything, ice, um, all of your safety and precautionary items, uh, the condoms, lubes, wipes, all that good jazz is all in here. And if you give us advance notice, as you can see, we'll decorate and make the party easier for you to just come in and have a good time. Welcome to Club Tempted's dance floor area. As you can see, we have two floors here, one for your dancing and one for observing. And it's, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun all the way around. Awesome. So do y'all have a dress code here? Uh, we sure do. On Friday nights, we always tell everybody it's casual. We tell everybody not to wear your work clothes or anything like that. Or if you do, come in and change, use the locker rooms, etc. And then on Fridays, we ask everybody to dress to impress, right? Mm -hmm. Fellas, always make sure you have a collared shirt on. The ladies are going to be dressed, yes. <laughs> <laughs> dressed to the max. We want to make sure that we look good for them. So where is nudity allowed? Okay, so on the first floor itself, there is no nudity prior to 10 o'clock. We ask everybody to keep covered up. Uh, at 10 o'clock, our DJ will make an announcement saying, all right, it's time to party, <laughs> and then everything can happen from there on. As far as the second and third floor, mm -hmm. anything goes from the time you get here. Awesome. Okay, John, tell us about these two VIP areas. All right, so this is our second floor VIP, which can be an add-on. Uh, you can rent these any night that we're open. You got to watch it because they go fast, right? But it is the happening spot of the club. Whenever you rent one of these, you will be uh, given 16 bracelets that you can pass out to any of your friends that you see in the club that you want to come party with you. Only those with bracelets are allowed in this area to keep you safe and make sure that it's a controlled environment. It's just not going crazy, yeah. right? All right. You are also provided with a swag bag from Adam and Eve, full of all kinds of goodies to have fun with through That's the exciting. night. exciting. <laughs> yes, it is. And then also, you honestly have the best view of the entire house from right up here. Welcome to one of the newest additions to Club Tempted. It's the second floor bathroom, shower rooms, and one of our newest play areas, the new dungeon. 
I love the vibe of this dungeon. Can you tell me a little bit about it? Yeah, absolutely. So this is our new dungeon. It is a considered a group playroom, six or more before you close the door. We tell everybody to be very respectful in this room. Uh, the BDSM community here is very strong and they have a very strong presence. So we always tell everybody, make your presence known, make your intentions known, and just be considerate of those that are putting on scenes in the room. Uh, everything that is, you would need to have a good time is in here. And then you are also welcome to bring any of your fun goodies that you might have from home to come in and have a good time with. Awesome. Okay, John, so are singles allowed at Club Tinted? Absolutely, they are. Awesome. We always go with 10% of the, the volume for the night. Okay. So singles can always come as long as tickets are available. Capacity on the building is 400, so we'd allow 40 singles to come in. Awesome. So. Okay, John, can you take me to the playroom? Absolutely, I'd love to. <laughs> but before we go, let's talk about a little etiquette. Okay. All right, so our play area is considered the third floor. Anytime we talk about the third floor, we always say to go up in groups of two or more. The only days that you don't go up in two or, uh, groups of two or more would be like the second and fourth Friday of the month. Those okay. would be considered the singles night where anybody can go anywhere in the club. But other than that, it's a great time. Let's go. All right, welcome to the first playroom it's on awesome. the third floor. We call this one our pillow room. All right, and this is another that's six or more before you close the door. For obvious reasons, you want to make sure that everybody's having a good time and has play, uh, you know, plenty of room to play. In the corners of all of our playrooms, you'll notice we have fresh sheets, towels, laundry. We have uh, baby wipes, lubricants, condoms, all the good stuff for making sure that you have safe play. One thing that we'd like to tell everybody to focus on, especially our guys, is make sure the condoms go in the trash not in the laundry. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So here at Club Tempted, we have sliding barn doors. None of our doors swing in and out. So all of them slide open and shut, right? So if you come upon a room that has a door closed, always be respectful and just go on to the next one. If it's closed for an excessive amount of time, you can always ask us to come check, <laughs> make sure everybody's okay. And then, uh, did you have any other questions? Yeah, what about the rope? When do they use the rope? Oh, okay, that's a great question. So if you want to put on a good show, right? And say you might be asking for some more help through the evening or you just want people to watch, you can always put the rope up. Uh, if you are on the outside of the rope, we always ask that you be respectful and keep uh, volumes to a low and just enjoy the show. The folks inside may invite you in, they may not, but nevertheless, you get to enjoy the show. Yeah. I'm obsessed with this fishbowl room. I think it might be my favorite one I've ever seen. It's uh, awesome. It's definitely a good time in here. Uh, the rules on this one, if you notice, there's no door on this one. It's mm -hmm. all about putting on a show and making sure everybody's watching. So yeah. if that's what you're into and that's your thing, this is the spot for it. Yeah. How many playrooms do you have in total here? Uh, we have 12 playrooms in total and hopefully looking to expand in the near future. That's awesome. John for taking me on this tour. If people are interested in coming, where do they find out more information? You simply just go to www.clubtempted.com oh. and you can check everything out on there, fill out an application, and then we'll get to you promptly. Awesome.